Margot Robbie was born in the family of farmer Mark Robbie and physical therapist Sari Kessler on July 2, 1990, under the sign of the Zodiac Cancer. The girl was nicknamed Lava in the family, which accompanied her for quite a long time. After the divorce of her parents, Margot, mostly lived with her mother and grandparents on their farm and with her father did not see. A huge influence on Margot's character development was her mother, as a physical therapist she worked first with the elderly, later with children with disabilities. During her school years she attended various clubs, from dancing to rowing, softball and theater, in high school her passion was surfing. She also met her first love in elementary school, Matthew Thompson. In 2007, Margot graduated from college in her hometown of Somerset and moved to Melbourne where she worked as a waitress, part-time maid and sales clerk. Part of the money earned Margot uses to study at acting courses, participates in various castings and in 2007 she got her first small role in the film ICU, which was not even printed in the credits of the picture, but in 2008 she got a role in the series Neighbours, and Australia talked about a new star. Margot Robbie starred in this series for three years in the role of Donna Friedman, for which she was nominated twice, in 2009 and 2011, for Logie Awards, but in 2011, she decided to go to America. Margot Robbie, after moving from Australia to the United States, lived in New York for several years. She actively participates in casting and gets the role of Laura Cameron in the series Pan American, where she starred until 2012. She is a fan of outdoor activities, skates in an amateur hockey team, sometimes spends time farming, loves riding a motorcycle, and of course surfing is a fan of the team New York Rangers. Regarding Margot's love of hockey, as she has said in various interviews, I would put on my rollerblades, pick up a field hockey stick and try my best to play something as close to hockey as possible. I've always loved ice hockey, but my skating skills ended up playing on an amateur team. Further Margot Robbie is involved in casting for roles in the movie Boyfriend from the Future and The Wolf of Wall Street. For the role of Naomi LaPaglia in tandem with Leonardo DiCaprio in Scorsese's The Wolf of Wall Street she won the Empire Award in the category of Best Female Debut, film critic Sasha Stone wrote. She is the best blonde found Scorsese since Kathy Moriarty in Raging Bull. Robbie is funny tough and killer in every scene. After working with Martin Scorsese about Margot began to talk she began to appear on the covers of glossy magazines, in particular Esquire, got to the top of the ratings of the sexiest stars in Hollywood. Since 2014, the actress has been receiving job offers and realizes herself in such films as French Sweet, Z Means Zachariah, Focus, was nominated for a BAFTA award in the category of Rising Star. In London on the set of the movie French Suite in 2014, she met assistant director Tom McAley and after three years of relationship, Margot Robbie and Tom got married in December 2016. The wedding ceremony took place in December 2016. The lovers got married in the actress's homeland, Australia. Only the closest friends of the bride and groom came to the wedding. One of the new London hobbies, became tattoos, according to rumors in her purse you can find a tattoo machine. In 2016 came out, Tarzan, Legend, Reporter and Suicide Squad, in which she played the role of Harley Quinn. Her work in Suicide Squad was highly praised and won her the award for Best Actress in an Action Movie at the 2016 Critics' Choice Awards. 2017 saw the release of two movies starring Margot, Goodbye Christopher Robin and Tonya vs. Everyone, in which she beautifully played the famous figure skater Tonya Harding and also acted as a producer for the movie. To participate in the movie Tonya Against All Odds, Margot learned to skate. For this movie, Margot was nominated for an Academy Award for Best Actress and a Golden Globe Award for Best Actress in 2018. Also, her work in this movie earned her a win for Best Comedy Actress. For this movie, Margot Robbie was nominated for a BAFTA Award, a Screen Actors Guild Award, a Producers Guild Award, and an Independent Spirit Award. 2019 saw the releases of three films starring her, Dreamland, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, 
and Scandal. For her work in the movie Scandal she was nominated for an Academy Award and Golden Globe Award for Best Supporting Actress and Critics' Choice Awards for Best Supporting Actress and Best Acting Ensemble. In this movie, Margot Robbie co-starred with Australian famous actress Nicole Kidman and South African star Charlize Theron. In 2020, the movie Birds of Prey. The Amazing Story of Harley Quinn, in which Margot returned to the role of Harley Quinn.